Through the prayers of our Holy Fathers, Lord Jesus Christ, our God, have mercy on us and save us. Rejoice, all saints of North America, 
who gave your lives to the Lord as an offering of love. Rejoice, all saints of the Lord. Sowing 
of Christ's divine word was cultivated in the hearts of your people through your faithful ministry. You uprooted tares of false teaching and brought forth a great harvest of faith here in the new world. Together with the holy apostles, we offer to you these words of loving praise. Rejoice, visionaries of the Orthodox Church in America. Rejoice, dispellers of spiritual darkness, of ignorance. Rejoice, O inexhaustible treasuries of divine wisdom. Rejoice, O zealous defenders of the one true faith. Rejoice, chosen successors of the holy apostles. Rejoice, O faithful guardians of the holy mysteries. Rejoice, O living icons of the evangelical life. Rejoice, O teachers of orthodox doctrine. Rejoice, all saints of North America, who gave your lives to the Lord as an offering of love. Rejoice, all saints of North America, who gave your lives to the Lord as an offering of love. The Lord sent you to this new land in order to enlighten its peoples with knowledge of God. Through your words, you have overcome the darkness of error and unbelief. Through your deeds, you have shown us the fruits of a virtuous life. Inspired by your labors and your ceaseless preaching of the gospel, we sing Alleluia. Alleluia, us the commandments of the gospel, following in your footsteps, O apostles and evangelists of North America. We sing to you these words of loving praise. Rejoice, O hierarchicon, pioneer of orthodoxy in North America. Rejoice, Father, innocent, missionary, and master of languages. Rejoice, faithful stewards of the divine household of the Lord. Rejoice, guardians of the mysteries of the kingdom of God. Rejoice, shepherds, protecting your flock from the enemy. Rejoice, O laborers, in the vineyard of Christ's holy church. Rejoice, O Raphael, blessed teacher of orthodox doctrine. Rejoice, zealous preachers of the Christ resurrection. Rejoice, all saints of North America, who gave your lives to the Lord as an offering of love. Rejoice, all saints of North America, who gave your lives to the Lord as an offering of love. of North America. In order to fulfill your Episcopal work, you sailed the great oceans and crossed vast continents. With diligence, you sought after your scattered flock and guided them to the shelter of the Lord's Church. As loving fathers, you fed your children with the teachings of the Gospel so that we all might sing Alleluia. Alleluia, Rejoice, O holy bishops, intercessors before the throne of Christ. Rejoice, Father Innocent, evangelizer of the northern peoples. Rejoice, Patriarch Tika, defender of the apostolic tradition. Rejoice, Blessed Raphael, teacher of the American peoples. Rejoice, Confessor Nicholas, spring of heavenly theology. Rejoice, teachers of the children of the heavenly Father. And teach our children. Rejoice, O divine clarions of the gospel of grace. Rejoice, O faithful stewards of the Holy Trinity. Rejoice, all saints of North America who gave your lives to the Lord as an offering of love. Rejoice, all saints of North America who gave your lives to the Lord as an offering of love. Guided by the grace of the Holy Spirit to cross the Pacific and Atlantic Oceans, on your way to the new world in order to fulfill your apostolic witness, so holy missionaries and evangelists of the North America. Following the legacy of St. Cyril Methodius, you translated the scriptures and all liturgical services into the tongues of the local peoples. 
and established schools for the training of native clergy. All of this you have done so that we might sing Alleluia. Alleluia, Alleluia. to nurture and edify the church which God obtained through the blood of his own son. As inheritors of your fruitful work, O sanctified hierarchs and evangelists, we sing to you words of loving praise. Rejoice, holy, heroic imitators of the chosen apostles Peter and Paul. Rejoice, teachers of the first principles of the gospel of God. Rejoice, honorable models of righteousness and holiness. Rejoice, trustworthy guides on the road of eternal life. Rejoice, O noble messengers of the grace of Jesus Christ. Rejoice, O good shepherds of the church in America. Rejoice, zealous instructors of Orthodox theology. Let's pray for our seminarians, those who study and teach in our seminaries. Rejoice, all humble servants, following the will of God. Rejoice, all saints of North America, who gave your lives to the Lord as an offering of love. Rejoice, all saints of North America.
life is a source of amazement to angels or righteous ones, known and unknown, of North America, assisted by the Holy Spirit, who firmly established the Orthodox faith in this new land. With patience and diligence, you built upon the foundation laid long ago with Christ as a cornerstone, as you built churches to the glory of God, having received from you the riches of the faith. We sing to God, Alleluia. Doing all things for the glory of God and the love of your neighbor, you fulfilled your calling to holiness, so righteous ones of North America. You accomplished the task given you according to you by the measure of grace given to you by the Lord. You finished the great, you fished the great waters of Alaska North. You tilled the fertile soils of Canadian and Midwestern plains. You labored under harsh conditions in mines and mills. You toiled day and night in factories in the American cities, all so that we might sing to you these words of loving praise. Rejoice, O oh faithful, who took up your crosses and followed Christ. Rejoice, honored citizens of the kingdom of heaven. Rejoice, O oh holy royal priesthood of the new Jerusalem, rejoice, O holy nation of the Prince of Peace. Rejoice, O chosen vessels of the Holy Spirit. Rejoice, O pillars of orthodoxy in America. Rejoice, O eternal city of the living God. Rejoice, pious teachers of the faith. Rejoice, all saints of North America, who gave your lives to the Lord as an offering of love. Rejoice, all saints of North America, amazement to angels and to men, O righteous ones of North America. The wisdom, word, and power of God begotten from his father before the beginning of time was incarnate in these last days from his holy mother, the Theotokos and ever Virgin Mary. To the grace of the Spirit, O blessed ones of North America, you thereby became partakers of the divine nature and have been perfected after the image of the one who is the express image of his divine Father, together with you, we sing to God, Alleluia. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. The King of Heaven and Earth humbled himself by taking the form of a servant in order to become the least and the last of the brethren. In his never-ending love for man, he poured himself out fully, so that we might be filled with all of the fullness of his grace. Following his example, O you righteous ones of North America, you served the ones to whom you were sent. You healed the sick, you gave aid to the poor, you sought out the lost, you raised infants, you guided the young people, you cared for the elderly, also that we might sing to you these loving words of praise. Rejoice, O holy bishops, gracious adornments of the land of North America. Rejoice, O hieromarchers, benefactors of the faithful living in the new world. Rejoice, O permanent evangelists, great preachers of the saving word of God. Rejoice, patient confessors, illumination of those living in darkness. Rejoice, O monastics, bright stars of the northern heavens. Rejoice, O blessed ascetics, wonder of angelic hosts. Rejoice, venerable fathers, guides of the fallen. Rejoice, holy mothers, wife of your children. Rejoice, all saints of North America who gave your lives to the Lord as an offering of love. Rejoice, all saints of North America. monastics, and all righteous men and women of North America, known and unknown, we beseech you as your spiritual children to intercede for us before Christ for the forgiveness of our sins. We worship the Lord who has given you to us as heavenly patrons and guardians for the protection and salvation of our souls and bodies together with heavenly hosts. We sing to God. Alleluia. Alleluia. We offer thanks to Christ for the wondrous deeds you have accomplished through him 
for the enlightenment of all of us, men, women, and children living in this new land. Together with God's elect, we sing to you these words of loving praise. Rejoice, O divine exaltation of the Rocky Mountains and the Pacific West. Rejoice, O gracious adornments of New England and the Atlantic States. Rejoice, joyful beacons of the Great Lakes and Midwestern Plains. Rejoice, O heavenly constellation of the Canadian provinces. Rejoice, wondrous aurora of Alaska and the Arctic North. Rejoice, O shining stars of North American continent. Rejoice, brilliant flowers of the southwestern deserts. Rejoice, O fragrant blossoms of the American South. Rejoice, O saints of North America who gave your lives to the Lord as an offering of love. Rejoice, O saints of North America who gave your lives to the Lord as an offering of love. O holy luminaries of North America, look down upon us, your sinful servants, and accept this present supplication. Entreat the Lord Jesus Christ that he will continue to bestow upon us and this monastery and the church in America his many mercies, be a refuge and a protection for our children so that we might be delivered from all physical and spiritual harm. Continue to guide our children and all of us into the heavenly kingdom so that we may sing Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. Alleluia, Alleluia. This present prayer and treat the Lord Jesus Christ that he will continue to bestow upon all of us his many mercies, be a refuge and a protection for us that we might be delivered from all physical and spiritual harm and continue to guide us and our youth into the heavenly kingdom so that we might sing Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. And treat the Lord Jesus Christ that he will continue to bestow upon us his many mercies, be a refuge and a protection for us that we might be delivered from all physical and spiritual harm. Continue to guide us and our children into the heavenly kingdom so that we might sing Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. Alleluia, Alleluia. Together with the body of the squires, we offer to you these words of loving praise. Rejoice, O holy Haraktika, patriarch of Moscow and enlightened of North America. Rejoice, O Haraginus, and Alaskan missionary and evangelizer of the Aleuts. Rejoice, O blessed Raphael, first bishop of Brooklyn and faithful shepherd. Rejoice, O holy Nicholas, confessor and teacher of heavenly theology. Rejoice, O venerable Herman, elder and wonder worker of Alaska. Rejoice, martyrs Juvenali and Peter. Martyrs, crowned for God by God, rejoice righteous Jacob, pastor and teacher of your flock, rejoice John and Alexis, defenders of the Orthodox way, rejoice all saints of North America who gave their lives to the Lord as an offering of love. Rejoice all saints of North America who gave their lives to the Lord as an offering of love. saints of God who have sanctified North America by your holy deeds, leaving your relics as seeds of the Orthodox faith, and who now stand before the throne of God in ceaseless prayer for our land. We sinners may dwell on this day to offer this hymn of praise to you. We exalt your great and holy deeds, O spiritual war warriors of Christ, who with patience and courage have vanquished the enemy completely, delivering us from his craft and cunning. We bless your holy lives, O lamps of God, who have shone with the light of faith and virtue, and have illumined our minds and hearts to the knowledge of God. We glorify your great miracles of flowers in paradise, who have blossomed in our land, spreading the sweet fragrance of your gifts and wonders. 
We pray to a love that reflects God's own love for the elders and intercessors and trustworthy helpers. We fall down before you and cry, O holy enlightenment, innocent and teacup. Help us, the faithful of North America, to preserve steadfastly the Orthodox faith that you have planted in us as a seed which, watered by divine rain, will bring forth fruit a hundredfold. Rejoice, confirm the church in North America by your prayers, and gather the scattered sheep into one flock, preserving it from all harm. The Holy Father Herman of Alaska, keep us from the delusions of this transitory life, that denying ourselves and taking up our cross, we may follow Christ, crucifying our flesh with his passions and desires, and bearing each other's burdens in love. O holy martyrs, Juvenali, and Peter, strengthen us in courageous perseverance, even to the shedding of our own blood for the Orthodox faith, so that no adversity may separate us from the love of God, which is in Jesus Christ. All saints, known and unknown, have shown throughout the history of this land. Remember our weakness and hardship, and by your prayers, beseech Christ our God that we, having successfully crossed the fathomless depths of the sea of life, keeping unharmed the treasury of the faith, may reach the harbor of eternal salvation and live in the kingdom of God, on high together with you and all who have served him throughout all ages, through the grace and compassion and love of mankind of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, to whom we love the glory with his Father and his most holy, good and life training spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages, amen. We great, with grateful hearts, we sing your praises and honor you, all saints of North America, who gave your lives to the Lord as an offering of love. You are the first fruits of Christ, bound to the harvest here in the new world. As faithful servants of your Master, you labored in the vineyard of his holy church. Through your example, you have shown us the joy of the Orthodox way. As we assemble today to honor you, we cry, Rejoice, O saints of North America, who gave your lives to the Lord as an offering of love. Rejoice, O saints of North America, who gave your lives to the Lord as an offering of love. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy, mighty, holy, immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. O most holy Trinity, have mercy on us, Lord, cleanse us from our sins, Master, pardon our transgressions. Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for thy name's sake. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil. Through the prayers of our holy fathers, Lord Jesus Christ, our God, have mercy on us and save us. Oh. 